What's up guys, it's the Blaming Guy, and welcome to another Dragon Ball Xenoverse character customization. This time, I will be doing Chrome Dokuro from Hitman Reborn. Now, she wasn't really that hard to to come up with, kind of, but the anime design reflecting on Dragon Ball Z's design kind of made it a little difficult, but it's still doable. You know, her hair is not kind of like a ponytail, or at least something similar to this, and her eyes are... They're kind of wide, and Hitman Reborn does have that kind of eye style that's pretty unique. But this is the closest I could have gotten to it. And the ears are normal, and all that is the same. I gave her small ears because it looks better. She's very tall, obviously, and uh, she's, she's very thin, to be honest. The skin color, most of the anime characters I found have this particular skin color. And her hair is like a dark purplish kind of thing going on it's it's the same like uh same with Mercuro's but it's basically Mercuro's hair which is like that kind of purple and her eyes match her hair which is I don't know if that's a running theme or like if certain anime characters have that like you know when their eyes match their hair color I don't know but yeah it's almost well almost the same I kind of made it a little darker because it looks better and the upper body we don't really have to worry about that now so we'll move on to the voice the voice, I gave her something like, you know, nice, soft, low, because she's kind of shy. And her name is obviously Kuromu Dokuro, which I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. Or if not, it's just Chrome. And yeah. So, we're going to confirm this, and she's kind of, she's kind of far-ranged and close because she has a staff but so I guess it's balanced and that's the initial body structure we're not gonna worry about colors right now I will show you what the finished product looks like and it's right here more or less the equipment now you have to keep the original uniform so sorry to say if you're trying to make this like a, a battle oriented thing then uniform won't really help you it's mostly a mix of the student skirt and the pilot suit and I know she has an eye patch but Dragon Ball Z sadly does not favor pirates, so I had to go with the scouter because that is literally the closest thing to an eye patch we are going to get at this point. And her colors are like this dark army green kind of thing because I know she had like a like that sort of dress thing in the back and black. Those are basically her two colors, just simple as that. And her skill set. So she is a psychic, among other things. So I gave her turtle style last resort because par paralysis more or less, evil eyes because random explosions in that anime happen sometimes, time control helps out a lot, Kaioken for her human factor, weekend to just to mix in a little bit of Mercuro in there, paralysis is a nice little another psychic touch, and psycho escape because it looks hilarious and silly. Overall this wasn't really that hard to make, except for the skin color, that took me a while. But yeah. Uh, hope you enjoy the montage, and I'll see you for another customization.